Hello everybody and welcome to step three of phonics. So now when your child is getting more confident in being able to recognise the phoneme, the sound and the grapheme, the written representation of all the individual letters in the alphabet and is starting to blend them, reading them in a written form, we start to introduce the next set of letters. Now there are many different phonics programmes that across the counties and even across the schools that get used. So you might, your school might be using Jolly Phonics, Read Write Ink, Letters and Sounds, Thras. So uh, the order that your child may have been taught these may be different from what I'm going to go through now, but the basic principle is the same. So. We start now getting to the point where two letters are then put together and they create a new sound. So this is a digraph. OK, it can be two or three letters, but we start by teaching two. So this is where we have then two letters that the children would have originally learnt as a s and a h. Now we're introducing the fact that these are a digraph or a special frame that together they make a new sound. In this case, sh. So usually the first set of digraphs or special friends that we teach are these. Shh. Children love this one. I say they get to stick their tongue out at you. It's the only time they can. Ng. Ch. Ng. So. Once they've started recognising these special friends, recognising the graphemes, we start to then encourage them to start blending it together. So always encourage your child to start by looking for any special friends or digraphs. So looking at this word, I'd expect them to start looking for shh. Then I'd get them to look for individual sounds. Oh, p, shh, oh, p, shh, oh, p. Then the word shop. Looking for special friends. Two in this case. Nk. Then individual sounds. I -nk. Then the word. I -nk. Think. They continue then learning new special friends or new digraphs. I'm going to go through these now. A. E. I O U U Oi Ow O U R Trigraph, three letters. Air. Oi. We encourage them to keep practicing these over and over again until they become fluent. As they're working through these, we then introduce them into blending them into words. So, for example, just a few examples. Again, special friends. A. Individual sounds. M. A. Word. May. Special friends. R. Sounds. S. T. R. Word. Star. Special friends. I. Sounds. M. I. T. Word. Might. Remember to keep encouraging, to keep the sounds pure, stretchy, being long, continuous, bouncy, short, and don't let them get away with having uh, sounds like L. We don't want that uh-huh coming into it. Okay, hope this has helped.